are the opening evening of our new venue, Pot Bedford, uh, and this is a creative hub that's here for six weeks, and it's basically run by creatives for the community in the heart of Bedford, and it's a project that is looking at using empty spaces uh, to kind of try and improve the town centre, essentially. Uh, so this is actually a pop-up shop where we've got like a six-week program of all sorts of events and activities. Uh, so it's fast and furious, so you haven't got long to come down and try it out. There's lots of free things going on, lots of artists in residence activities, lots of co-creating and a big final exhibition at the end. And then uh, in some other windows around town, we've got pop art displays. And that is just using the window space for art. It's very easy and cheap to do for landlords if you're listening. Uh, we need your window spaces, please. And then the other part of the project is Pop Studios, which is about using spaces for shared artist studios, because there's such a big creative community in Bedford. My name is uh, Nita Dredd. I run a sound system in Bedford called Culture Root Sound System. I've been doing it for, uh, I started back in September 1979. This is my collection here that I've collected over the years. I, I didn't really know I was ever going to do something like this. It was just a collection that I put together over the years. My favourite piece is this piece here, which is the gramophone, which is very clever. Because yeah. if I show you, right, when it's actually playing, and the volume is here. That's the volume. I built that when I was 23 years old. Well, basically, it's a control unit that controls the treble, the mid-range and the bass and the microphone. So, back in the day, you couldn't, you couldn't get a mixer. Now that we use a mixer, but in the reggae world, so to speak, we build our own equipment like that. That's called a preamp. Our website is um, culturebeats.com. You go to culturebeats.com, that is our, our website. I'm a local artist. I um, have a. My name's Lisa Tilly, but I also am called You Old Bag. I make bags and uh, accessories. But I also make art with textiles and run workshops. And I'm artist in residence next week when I will be making cloths, brick shaped cloths that people can decorate. Um, and the theme is, this is Bedford and what Bedford means to the, the people of Bedford. So you would come and you would decorate a cloth with imagery. You can bring photos of your own inspiration if you like, that would be wonderful. And we will we'll put them on the wall here. We would like to encourage um, people from all different groups. Um, in particular different ethnic groups that have migrated, moved to Bedford and why they came here because I'd like to highlight the reasons for those um, but it's really for everyone and anyone, all ages and abilities. I have just started the Good Life Garden and we will be doing two sessions at Pot Bedford. Uh, the first one on the 3rd of August will be a session open to families, all ages, everybody welcome and we'll be making flower crowns, there'll be sensory play for children and there'll be baby toys as well if you've got very little ones. It is donation only so pay what you can if you can. I'd love everyone to come along and get involved, it's going to be a very chilled atmosphere, come and have a cup of tea, chat to other parents and get creative with nature. And on the 10th of August, we'll be making wildflower seed bombs.